Every year, ABC 27 honors four remarkable women. Inevitably, these women don't consider themselves remarkable. We are here to share what makes them so. And this year, that includes Carlisle's Amy Marino. This is our living room. This is our community living room. As Amy Marino walks around the home where she raised her children. It's just a place where they can laugh and fellowship and just unwind from the day. Her eyes sparkle with the enthusiasm of someone who's found the secret to happiness. So I was a youth pastor um, of a youth group that really attracted a lot of at-risk kids and some of those children were in the foster care system. In addition to being a wife and mom, Amy loved the kids in her youth group, including Brittany. Super loving, very optimistic. And Brittany felt so comfortable with Amy, she one day asked a question that would change the course of both their lives. Can I live with you? And she was like, sure, yeah. I think she thought I meant like to stay the night. But I looked in her eye and I just knew there was something different about her and her situation and I knew a little bit about her story. Brittany was in what she describes as a bad foster care situation. She wanted out. Amy, her husband, and three daughters welcomed her in. And within a week after we brought her in her home, the teachers are like contacting us and saying, what's going on? Like Brittany's a different student. Eventually, Amy adopted Brittany. This house was also like always loud and like full of laughter. And like, I can remember weekends where we would just sit around the table and laugh all day long. And I don't know, it just, I love this house. Every year, 1,100 Pennsylvania teens age out of the foster care system. Statistics show that one in four face major problems, including homelessness, substance abuse, and unwanted pregnancy. Amy's former work with Cumberland County Children and Youth Families taught her that. We started to question how many more young ladies are there that age out of the foster care system and have nowhere to go. One year ago, Amy converted her former home into Bethany House. So this is just one of our guest rooms. This is Transitional housing for four young women aging out of foster care. She and her volunteers prepare them for adult life. Anything that they need, we just meet them where they're at when they come into the home and begin setting goals immediately. Bethany House provides love, structure, and stability, just what Amy provided for Brittany. Like Superwoman? Seriously, like the woman of the year. An ABC 27 remarkable woman. You know, this remarkable women contest is really hard for me to take because I'm not the remarkable woman. I've seen these young ladies and I've heard their stories and I haven't been through half of what they've been through. She's just the greatest. Mm -hmm. And to meet our other remarkable women, please visit our website, abc27.com. And then be sure to watch Good Day PA on April 4th as we reveal the big winner. And then on April 8th at 7.30 p.m., all four of our finalists will be featured in a half-hour special, of course, right here on ABC 27, Remarkable Women of Central Pennsylvania.